Hello everybody, it's me, Lindsay Rogers. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And I'm going to address something before any of you guys go ahead and end up hitting the dislike button. Just understand what's going on. You see, I have been dealing with issues within my family. Sorry, I'm kind of uh, dealing with vape burps because I, my food I ate, so that's not the reason. So what I was trying to say is, but I have been dealing with issues with my family. And it has to do what's been going on since, I guess you want to say that since we're in election year, it's been really bad. What I mean by really bad is that I get a little too crazy when it comes to elections. However, I am not going to be bullied by somebody. And what I mean by is that this has always happened every year. Not sorry, every four, actually, not every year. It either happens every two or every four years. There's, I mean, bullied by my father. There. Just because. Just because of the choices that he thinks that I should do, be like him. Well, guess what? I'm not going to be bullied by this. Just because he wants me to be like him, his mother, and his brother, I'm not. I'm not going to be be bullied, mean pushed to something that I do not want. I, yeah, if I want to vote for this upcoming election and and I'll choose my own if I want to vote for Trump or if I want to vote for Biden. But I'm not going to be bullied to, to push to be pushed to vote for one candidate. Hey. And the reason why is because my father is treating me like a child. He's been actually doing this for quite a while. You know, he make fun of my weight. He's been he just bullied me. He thinking that oh I should get on start on losing weight. Hey. So, eight, so I can beat my brother? I'm like, wait, are you treating me like I'm a kid? Because, to tell you the truth, he hasn't treated me with respect. My mother does. So does my brother, despite he's being a pain in the you know where. You know? They treat me with respect, I treat them back with respect. Not him. He's treating me like a child. You thinking that I'm that I won't do anything unless I would? And this is because he thinks, you know, he thinks this is the right thing to do. It's not. To bully, to harass somebody, it's not even a good thing. It is an embarrassment. Right. Just because you want me to vote the way you vote. Not my own choosing. And it makes me very frustrated and angry. To the point that I cannot handle this. This. So, <laughs> I decided to, you know what? I'm just going to simply like, ignore him because I do not want to wake up every morning and, and get a text message at 8 o'clock in the morning while I'm trying to figure out how to get back to sleep okay, because otherwise I go up, I have to go tell my mother and she gets very upset about this. And because of that, he does and. You know, he's done. He's doing things that he's thinking he's trying to get in on my mother's good side. Well, he hasn't been. 
And, you know, like in the last video, I told you guys that we have squirrel issues. He goes, you know what he said to her? Eh, why don't you go buy, buy some something that will get rid of it. Get rid of squirrels. Not... Oh, let me help you out. Let's me think. I'll fix the issues. You know? That's how the appropriate way to say this. No, not for my father. There. You know, he thinks it's all right for bullying me, treat me like a child, and not treat me with respect. You know? It made my mother so angry and upset. I mean... I think she's still mad at him ever since he hit me in the face when I was just 20 years old. And, you know, even though she kind of really kind of messed things up, saying that she kicked him out because, because of, um, for, because after she, after he hit my brother, but it was actually, he kicked him out. She kicked him out when he was cheating on her. Or committing infidelity and stuff. You know? And then he's thinking, he's trying to get him back into her good graces. And just fix things. Well, guess what? That's not the only thing he failed to do. Not only since he had hit my brother... There, when he refused to go to school because my mother called him, um, and, and, and he comes in, he beats him, and that, and believe me, I was laying down in bed when this happened one time. He, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm not feeling well. I, I'll, I needed some rest. Yet, here comes my brother, scared for his life, and suddenly my father starts to hit him. I should have, you know, with my knowledge today, I could have stopped him back then and saying, What are you doing? You think it's okay to come in this house, come in my room and beat him? What is wrong with you? No, but she really let it happen. But, of course, not only because of what he didn't do for, not only just because he abused my, not only did he hit my brother and then b hit me when I was 20, not only that, <laughs> he refused to pay mom support. Even though she could have gone to a judge and uh, get a lawyer and judge and hedge and sue the crap out of him and force him to pay a a support she didn't that in fact I was worried that she, that she, we were going to be broke turns out my mother they figured out a lot of things she worked hard she had switched jobs and the next thing you know we're no longer in debt And she's, you know, and she's out, and she's fine with that. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to keep this in. <sighs> sorry, I'm just trying to fight this. But, not for my father. You thinking, you know, try to bully somebody to do something that he wants and not what I want is disgusting. Then because it's gonna continue on treat me like a kid. I know most of you guys are probably thinking, oh, why is you probably treating him like a kid? He sounds like a complete Republican Nope. Nope, don't go there. He doesn't vote that way. And that's why. Hey. And 
I know most should probably. I know some will scream. Why? He should be you. Why? He should be. He's doing the right thing. No, he's not. No, he's not. And anybody who says that that my father's doing the right thing, well, guess what? You're wrong. Because most of you guys don't get it. it. The way how I am right now is just that what he did to me last yesterday and today was very unacceptable. Because of that, that I told him off. And that was it. Now, the only thing... thing and I'm just letting you know, besides of that, is, well, my poor uncle, he got hurt somehow today, and uh, he ended up in the hospital. But I'm pretty sure right now he's probably fine. It's just that my aunt is trying to make sure that he's fully checked. And I mean fully checked, as in having making sure because ever I think because my mother said that said to me that what she heard from my aunt that my uncle's not eating well he's losing a lot of weight and uh, they want to know why well my aunt want to know why because because otherwise, I don't know what will happen if my uncle is... Sorry. I tried to do the th snap, as in, you know, Thanos snap. <laughs> yeah, I've seen the memes. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what it is. <sighs> so, pretty much I can say that. Uh, it's just that... My mother just wanted to make sure for my... My mother just wanted to... T mother had this up... Having my aunt talk to her and stuff, you know. The other thing is... Yeah, I kind of am a little bit annoyed right now because with Wawa and the... And Visa and... Not, not as in Visa as in something have to deal with... Um, government. It's actually Visa as in Visa Bank. You see, <laughs> I got on to, uh, I found out on, let me talk to you about these and, and about this. So let me explain about the Wawa situation. Apparently, Wawa says that the turkey gobblers is out and it should be available on the app. Well, it wasn't. And it's that when I found out, until I went to Wawa, and it turns out they have it, but it was not on the app. So, that was an awkward situation. Now, for the Visa Bank situation, well, my mother and I, and of course my brother, all three of us belong to a local bank. Now, our local bank, somehow... has these cards, right, and it has the Visa logo on there. Well, ever since my mother had an issue when she suckered into a scam and she had to try to get it canceled and she had to have that card closed down. Well, apparently, she got her new card and the next thing you know, <laughs> Visa is simply denying her purchases. This. From time she was at ShopRite to the wallet situation, and then, and when she went to go try to get um, something that deals with the squirrels, our squirrel situation, she got very upset about this. Well, this morning she told me that uh, she called the lo the uh, the local bank, Hank, Hank. She talked to a woman, and explaining what, who she probably knows. They probably both know. Probably already forgot. <laughs> um, she texts her, "Go call fraud protection." So she did, and somehow I don't want to sound mean or anything, but the guy was sounds like he was speaking in another language, and it made my mother upset. 
accent. And I and I know it's probably because he's speaking in the, some kind of broken English. And my mother feels like she, not, he's not speaking English. And understand it's probably because my mother is hearing Frank. I mean, she hasn't gone seen a child. She hasn't gotten uh, a hearing aid. aid until they have to get rid of the ear hair in her, in the hair in her ear because she that's also because that in because the ear in her the hair in her ear is making her feel dizzy. I'm like really. So yeah. So that's what's been going on, and. So, sorry, that was just the wind blowing. So, yes, my mother is kind of really dealing with this kind of crap. And I think that's what's making her very upset with the, um, when she had to talk to somebody at Fraud Protection who must have spoken to her in a broken English. And, uh, apparently she... She she got you kind of. She said she was kind of. She kind of went completely crazy, and she says that she'll get a lawyer to sue, sue a uh, visa. <laughs> if they didn't fix it right away, so they did. <laughs> I but I understand then how upset she is, but you know. You can't be messing around with somebody's uh, money for this. Yes. So because of that, everything's fixed. She's feeling happy about it, and uh, so am I. Because otherwise, I really, I would end up using my card, and uh, I don't know. It feels weird about it. But anyway, so something's up. Yes, everything is fine for now except for my father's complete jerk anyway i hope you guys understand if you do please hit that like button if you are new to my channel please hit that subscribe button make sure notifications are definitely turned on and i will see you guys in the next video until then bye